John, uh, big win for you today. Uh, led from start to finish. Great defensive effort at the start of the game. Is this maybe one of the most gratifying wins of the season? Oh, it's, it, it's a good win for us. It really is. And, and it's great for the guys because this is our third game in a row that we've defended. You know, we've competed at a certain level on the defensive end. It's something we've been talking about. And again, it takes time for it to fully come together. Um, you watch the game. We didn't play flawless on D by any stretch, but the effort is there. Guys are starting to cover up mistakes with effort. Um, and we finally found a way to get a win today. So it was, it was great. I feel really good for this group. Uh, a lot of people contributed today, both on both sides of the court. Can you talk a little bit about that? You know, we got 12 guys that can play. I mean, and, and again, it's not easy as young guys because everybody's a competitor. Everybody, in a good way, has an has a ego to a certain extent. They, they want minutes. They want to play. Um, and everybody stepped up. I mean, guys, you're probably not referencing, but DJ <coughs> Jackson, uh, Bill Lewitt, who was not played in a few games, and then obviously Brandon Jackson and Kenyon and, and Jalen Henry got in foul trouble. Those three guys came in and held down the fort on our front line, and those were huge, huge minutes in the first half. Uh, Keenan had a season high of 14 today. Can you talk a little bit about his play and David too, 15, 11 in the second half? Yeah, these guys have been consistent. I mean, again, and they work at it though. They, they put time in extra. They come in, they work on the game. Uh, we watch a lot of film as a unit, you know, and it's, it's good to see them have a little success. I mean, this will be a confidence boost for them going into next week. Both guys did some really good things. Keenan, just talk about how nice it was to get this win after a couple tough home losses by one point. Uh, this was a really good win for us. You know, we just kept on fighting and kept on practicing hard and just got the win. David, talk about your three there late. I mean, you guys were up by five, and it looked like Coach was kind of saying to slow it down a bit and walk right into a three and hit it. Uh, yeah, I just stepped up confidently. You know, Coach said if it's there, then let it ride. I mean, you know, I felt confident enough to shoot it, and I just knocked it down. And both of you guys, you had a, a big lead. They made a run at you, but you didn't. Uh, you didn't buckle, didn't will at all. What what does that say about the way you played down the stretch? Well, coach always, we practice on things like that. So we're well prepared through practice. We do everything that we're going to do in the game. So, you know, them things like that don't phase us at all. So, you know, you see that out there on the court. Either of the players, how important was that start today? It's, you get off to a quick 9-2 to two lead. Oh, that's always very important. You know, we just came out focused and came out strong. John, can you talk about that, you know, stretch at the end of the game when they came back on you, but you guys proved to be really resilient and closed it out the right way? I mean, it's, it's a reason Jacksonville State's, uh, you know, in third place in our league. I mean, it's a very, very well-coached team. Uh, they got a lot of talent, a lot of ability on that team, and, and I mean, they made a run. I mean, that's what they're supposed to do. You know, they got a lot of fight in them. Our guys, as you mentioned, have a lot of resolve as well, and uh, again, our confidence is starting to grow. These guys are really starting to see what we're capable of. And we responded, you know, to their run on our home floor, and that's what we're supposed to do. So uh, I, I give Jacksonville State a ton of credit, you know, but again, our guys stepped up and, and made plays when, they, when we needed to. So is it the, the defense, or I so see you have rebound on 34-31 that sort of maybe pleased you the most today? Yeah, no question. I mean, because that, that's one of the better rebounding teams in America, not, not, not just in our league. Uh, they're big, they're athletic, and, and they go hard, you know, so that's not easy to do. How we brought that team by three was big, and, and honestly, I think that was a difference. That was a difference in the game. You know, we held them to six second chance points. I mean, that's a that's a big time number against that front line. David, you guys were able to build a 17 point lead there in the first half, and they made a run to come back. What was the message at halftime? Uh, just keep the energy up. I mean, stay positive when we come back out there. Coach said, I mean, they made their run. You know, they're going to do that. Is the reason why they third place in our league, but. Other than that, we just keep defending and we'll come out with the win. John, it was alumni day today and the, the first team was here. Was that, uh, uh, you know, uh, I don't know to say inspired you guys, but I mean, you took notice of that, all the people here. I mean, it's great. I mean, it's, it's um, you know, we're actually going to go meet those guys. And Mike Shannon's really looking forward to that. Um, and it's always special when you can have your alumni back. Um, and not just your alumni, I mean, the first team, you know, we wouldn't be here without what those guys did. So it's pretty cool to have them in the building. Pretty special day uh, for our guys, no doubt. Okay, guys, thank you. Congratulations. Thank Keep you. It up. Thanks, guys. Thank you, guys.